time the next fellow then warms up, we're going to get Rina Hire Tom Fater's coach, I think. Here we have Raj out there in the field. One of the more handsome players that we've ever seen to grace this field here at Huahin, Colonel Raj Kalan. We had an interview with him earlier and we'll, I'm sure, Improvement, a tremendous level of improvement from these all black players. Yeah, it's really brilliant. I mean, uh, Charles Reichelman scored some really good goals the other day. He told me before he went on he was going to score, and of course he went and did it. And, um, you know, it's given him that extra ammunition. He's out to score a few more, so he's, uh, he's looking good. Um, and, uh, you know, he's uh, it's going to be very good. Here come the British Army team. Cameron will probably be back at center. We've got Charlie on defense. As usual, there he is in the blue helmet, and we've got it up on the team. Gentlemen had an amazing game. Three or four goals, and then the Casa Corn Bank took it to them. So they've they had a lot of lessons learned yesterday, and let's see how they will do today. They're lining up now for a vote photograph, the British Army team with the All Blacks. This is going to be a lovely photo indeed. So we need Raj to put his stick in the air. Come on, Raj. Sticks up. Sticks over your head. What a nice Robin. picture that is. Robin, stick over your head. There you go. Nice. So you have a traditional World Cup rivalry here between the English. Close in, Charlie. Close in. Well in yeah. the English and the Kiwis, of course, uh, will be battling it out in the World Cup of Rugby over the next eight weeks. And these two titans of rugby are also now titans of elephant. Hello. Oh, gentlemen, okay, get your heads clear from your Mahout's head in the back there. There you are, Charlie. Well done. You can't see you, Felix. Pop your head up a bit. There you go, there you go. Move it out to the side. Good, guys. Very handsome indeed, especially with... Sure, and we'd like, Peter, do you have some feelings that you'd like to share with us? I just would like to remind everybody that one of the very first supporters of Elephant Polo was Sir Redmond Hillary, the first man to climb Everest. He was the first All Black ever to play in a New Zealand shirt, and that was back in uh, the 1980s. So it's great to see the All Blacks back, New Zealand here, and I'd like to feel that we all would uh, be considering this as almost a tribute match to the great work Sir Redmond Hillary did, not just for the ball, but also in supporting Elephant Polo. Peter Hall, oh, thank you very much. And here we go, Dobbs has laid down the gauntlet. Is there going to be a huck on the elephants? Look at Raj, Raj says why not? There They're putting go. the sticks down. That's Ladies and gentlemen, elephant. we're going to see first ever in history, the first time ever in history, a New Zealand all black huck on the back of an elephant. Ladies and gentlemen, get ready. Raj, take off your helmet and keep that left glove on. Ladies. Woo! Fantastic, unbelievable, very, very nice, ladies and gentlemen. The first time in history ever, ever, that we have seen a haka from the back of an elephant. Jeffrey Dobbs, what a splendid idea. Thank you very much. Your Royal Highness, the Grand Toko of Taprobane for this tremendous idea. And what a performance, especially with Raj out there, just like he was up on the Pakistan border. A lovely day, we salvaged the day after the rains. And I would say that the crowds are picking up and um, we are looking forward to a very, very exciting game now with the All Blacks. And do you have any idea how they're going to line up today? I have a feeling that uh, maybe Raj might go in the middle here. We are at 11 uh, Normally goes defensive, but uh, he seems to be on the D2, so it looks like um, he's got way back into defensive mode. Uh, be like this. Raj back on defense, sending Charlie up on attack. Robin in there at the center. Robin going up against Cameron. We saw Cameron in the center yesterday. And of course, uh, 
our ever-present umpire John Roberts at center field wearing a black umpire shirt. And the ball's in play. And a nice little chip shot there by Robin. Robin, I might say, is on a very fast D1 elephant. And look at him accelerating. Oh, there we go, Robin Brooks. Fantastic dribbling here from the, the mighty old black Robin Brook going towards the D, ladies and gentlemen. He's moving into the D here. This is a quick goal. <laughs> Two of them, oh, oh, What a stellar there. defense by Charlie. Robin now pulling it around. He's got, he's lost it in the legs of Charlie's elephant. Charlie's going from near to off, near to off. He's pulling it out of the D. What a fantastic defensive maneuver. It's a real quick forward push here by the, the, the forwards of the Kiwi pack coming through. Isn't that easy? Uh, is, uh, <laughs> and Cameron now on top of that ball looking to defend it. It's a chip shot underneath his trunk. And here comes Charlie. Too lazy, What about it down? There's Robin Brook riding off Cameron Humphreys. There's a piece of strapping has come off the ground now. That's funny. So here comes Cameron. Up as far as Raj Kalam. Taking a forward attacking role in defense, which is a clever move. The old blacks are now through, and it's Robin Brock. He's through on goal, ladies and gentlemen, number 12 here. And it's going goal bound, ladies and gentlemen. It's going goal bound. This could be an all for the All Blacks. Is it going to go through? And it's a uh, goal. <laughs> Fantastic All Black goal there to equalize because there was a handicap advantage for the. Oh, yeah. Is there starting to fall? A light drizzle on the field. <laughs> uh, that's a great goal there, uh, Tom. Uh, very fast. What was the time on that goal? It, uh, not, not the fastest goal. We're about a minute and 45 into that first chuck up when we got the first goal from the Old Blacks. Right. And uh, Cameron has been playing such a fantastic tournament. It's really exciting. Yeah, Hong Kong. Uh, Pretty much vodka on that one, Cameron. Lovely open field polo, though, from Cameron. And it's going to be interesting to see My if the Reigns change the play on the pitch. But this squad, it doesn't look as though they have. From the uh, crowds are building up here, as you can see on the stadium stand here. It's beginning to look like Wimbledon around here. And there's Raj off the back line. It's a very firm strike up to Robin. Robin now tickling that ball forward. He's going up against Cameron, but he's ripped him off now, going to the sideline. He's lost it. He's left it for Felix Gedney. Felix is going to get there. Felix goes with a back shot, but nobody's there. He passed it to no one. Raj with a little bit of a backhand to Robin. Cameron turning around, lovely pass under his elephant to Felix. Is Felix going to wind up and shoot or is he going to top it into the D? He's tapping, he's going left. And remember, you can only have two defensive players in the D. He's lost yeah. it underneath his elephant now. Cameron on his own, going back on defense. He's going to go for that backhand. It's a lovely one, right into the D. Raj is on a very fast D2. He's there first. And a lovely clearance shot by Raj. Felix with a beautiful defensive play. He had it, but he lost it. Now Cameron with a chance at a backhand over the top. Second time lucky. Yeah. Felix has turned on it now. But here we have a lovely fast little D1 elephant and Felix has still got it. Felix is now bent over there, tapping it almost into the D. Raj now back with a nice backhand. And Robin's missed it. Robin turning around though. He's over the top of it, and we did have a whistle. He taps it through, but uh, really not anyone there. So now Follow the ball. Charlie coming down. <laughs> what a beautiful shot by Charlie Reichelman into the D there. Look at this. Here we have it. Oh, Robert Brooke. Attack. He's, <laughs> he's got it. He's 
just over the top. Oh, oh he's just hanging on there. There we go. Is Robin Brook on his elephant or is he falling off? Off the right side of that elephant. There's a lot of a lot of all black there to heave back onto that elephant. But they've done it. They, once you list past that mid buoyancy point. We really should get a little star seat for uh, our uh, uh, friend Robin Brooks in my store. But Robin has recovered very, very well and quickly. Oh, nice beautiful backhand, back nice backhand all the way down. Into space again. Now nice defensive play by Charlie coming to block the all black. It's a nice pass downfield, but I think it's probably going to go out. Now, Raj Kaman, I think, is quite capable of hitting this through the goal from there. Let's say if he winds up. With one of the spectacular shelves, you can see this road all the way because it's slight downhill. Raj winding up, there it is. Not quite a lot on it. And now Cameron now is going to come back the other way, being chased by Robin. What a lovely pass, the pass of the tournament, I might say. Cameron on the near side. Tipping up to Felix now. Felix is going towards goal. He's right there, right in front of goal. And he's going to the British Army team with a lovely, lovely goal. One of the nicest passes we've seen.